In fact, we can hear songs about how lonely people are everywhere. Because people are truly, indeed, lonely everywhere. Every person will feel lonely anytime, anywhere. It is like an unavoidable disease. Although we can't avoid feeling lonely, we can transfer it. So now, I would like to ask, how could we transfer lonely into fulfillment? In the movie Cast Away, Tom Hanks was a strong survivor. However, no matter how strong one is, one still couldn't bear the feeling of loneliness. Therefore, did you know what he did? He talked to a volleyball. He drew a ball by his blood and named him Wilson. It is such an unforgettable thing in this outstanding movie because it reveals that people are social animals and where, when, they, when people are lonely for such a long time, they will do some weird things. However, in the reality, loneliness may lead to many much more odd and terrible behaviors. But if we can convert those bad behaviors into some kind of motivation, and then we can make ourselves a better person. So now, I am going to show you some examples and common things people will do when they are lonely, and how we can transfer it. First, I want to share a movie. Has everyone seen the top one of the 100 classic movie, The Shawshank Redemption? In the movie, the main character was called into jail for a crime he didn't commit. In the jail, he was abused, bullied, or even suffered from the most severe punishment to be locked in a dark room for alone for one month. It is a punishment we often see in an army or a jail because it is often considered as a final punishment because it forces people to face loneliness. Some people may get crazy or get depressed there. However, the character did a marvelous work in the jail. Why? Because he transferred his loneliness into his face and goal. And what is his goal? His goal is that he must escape from the jail. So what he did, he used 10 years to dig out a tunnel by using several small rocks. And not only did he help himself, he also helped other prisoners. He educated them, and he made true friends there. It is because he, he transferred his loneliness into face and go, so he conquered his loneliness. Second, loneliness may make person uh, be addicted to bad habits. Lonely people paralyze themselves by taking drugs, alcohol, or even having so much sex. They try to escape from the reality and deal with loneliness by experiencing the extreme happiness and craziness. And finally, when they try to correct themselves, it is usually too late. So how can we deal with loneliness in a healthy way? We can go to church or join the charities. All in all, all of these acts aim to let us to find a, find a belief and find a sense of belonging make us feel that we truly exist and are really needed, rather than running away from the reality and throwing ourselves into a world that only exists in our mind. Third, I would like to talk about the loneliness we often face, the need for a valentine. I believe everyone wants a girlfriend or a boyfriend, a soulmate to stay aside you. So, I believe everyone has the experience such like, sometimes we will cry bitterly alone when we think of some bitter or sweet memories. When we hear of, about our former lovers, when we hear a familiar song, or just some simple few notes. Or sometimes we will watch Hollywood love movies and soap opera while we dig in a tub of ice cream and curling in the armchair. So what is the thing that let us stop to go outside? and breathing the fresh air. It is the loneliness and sadness which collapses us. To transfer a sloppy, messy person to a happier, energetic one, I think it is the best reason for the existence of so many clubs, 
so many activities and so many organizations. You can conquer your loneliness by just stepping out. You can join the club activities, go playing sports, go seeing and traveling with your friends. Try hard to improve your skill, like join the Toastmasters groupie, or cultivate your ability. <clears throat> by doing this, eventually, you will gradually forget the feeling of loneliness. Finally, loneliness can be your enemy or your friend. Just depend on how you treat it. If we can deal with it in right way, by opening your mind instead of closing it, then we can really transfer loneliness into fulfillment. Back to TME.